Hey everybody, how's it going? I want to do a unpackaging and review of the Milwaukee Cushion Grip Screwdriver Set. We have a part number of 48-22-2885. Most durable handle, precision fit. We did kind of slightly open it, that way we wouldn't have to struggle so much one-handed. So let's get going. Just gonna sit you down here for a sec. And pull these suckers out. It is a five piece set. Packaging is very, very secure. And uh, this product I ordered online from homedepot.com um, Milwaukee does have a couple other sets in store but I really did want the uh, cushion grip set simply because uh, it's a little different visually and uh, it shows that functionally it'll be pretty different as well from the rest of the Milwaukee screwdriver sets that are out there so now that I have everything unboxed let me show you what it comes with we have a flathead number one Phillips number two Phillips a uh, longer flathead and a number two square I got this one because it only comes with a number two square I really don't use the number one square too much but uh, the flathead there's a one quarter inch and a three sixteenth inch so we have here these uh, ridges for grip, magnetic tip, and uh, the grip, the black is you know, quite rubbery. The one thing I do like is the tips. I like that Milwaukee likes to put their symbols on the back. But check this out. The flathead right here. It's got this little ridge. And that's pretty cool because let's say I'm busy with my hands full trying to get a piece out. And I can't turn my body too much. See that? That's an indentation plus for Phillips so you have a straight dash or flathead again plus for the Phillips in it you can feel it pretty good I'm pretty sure if you were wearing some uh, some latex or nitro gloves you'd be able to feel it in a square the square tip do like that it's pretty cool And it is rubber. You have a little clear right there, and you have these ridges here so you can put a, an open end wrench to give it some more torque on whatever you're trying to spin on and off. So, we're going to do a little test. I have here 
a 50 amp Eaton to BR type. BR250. So there's two pole. You see there that's a square square tip. Alright, there you can see it. Alright, so let me get my square tip. It's in there real good. Nice. And it just it does fit. It sits real snug in there as well. So So that's my square tip. So those ridges there you can Grab it by here. Of course, you don't want to try and touch that when there are live wires and the breaker is on. And it'll turn curly air into straight air. Uh, the next one we're going to do, I got a, I don't know if this is a Eaton or a Siemens, but I believe it is Siemens. And it is a 70 amp breaker. Two pull. This one is slotted. So we're gonna go ahead and try and go for I do have my uh, three eighths. So we'll do one with the three eighths, one with the uh, quarter on there. So see there. Sit nice. Nice and smooth. Get by the ridges right here. So, once again, you don't want to touch a metal screwdriver when you're screwing or tightening hot wires. You don't want to end up getting yourself zapped. Let's touch our one quarter to it. This is the longer one. We'll get this side. And I can feel the magnetic tip trying to grip onto there. So uh, one thing I did notice here is that the longer flathead does not have the ridges on it. Well that's alright. I do like it. I'll take it. And so there's my review. Um, tell you the one thing that I did not like about this set was that it didn't come with a six inch flat head and number two Phillips like a couple of their other sets do so and I don't believe that they sell cushion grip 6 inch flat headed number 2 Phillips so I'll have to find something else but there it is my Milwaukee cushion grip screwdriver set and uh, once again have a nice day